This guy, I can't take him anywhere. Get to the back of the line. Yo, como están? It's Wild on Tuesday, and thank you for joining my channel. Please hit the like, the subscribe, and the bell for future notifications. This week, we're going to be going over a topic that I get messaged a lot about, and that is, as a supporter, what's expected of me, especially if confronted by a rival MC? So, yeah, go ahead. And I'm going to talk about what I talked about before in another video about the basic expectations of a supporter. A supporter is not a junior member of the club. It is a role, and it's an important role, and there is a way to do it. To be a supporter, you need to show up for the event, buy tickets for the event. Uh, that's another thing. You, you can only support one club. You cannot support various clubs. You can have friends in other clubs, but you better not wear their gear if you support another club. So a main question I get a lot is, if I go to another state, do and uh, knowing that there's a rival MC there, uh, do I have to wear my support gear? Well, no, you don't have to wear the support gear. But if you're supporting that club, you're supporting that club, no matter where you go. There's a time to be dumb, though, and a smart time, too. But when you are confronted by another MC, and they're mud-checking you, don't act surprised. What I'm seeing a lot lately is, folks want all the reward, no risk. But by putting on the support gear, you take on the risk. And that's the risk you have to take. The saying goes, as a supporter basically, all risk, no reward. Because you always hear these guys say, give me brotherhood. I want a ready-made club. I don't want to have to do much. I just want to buy my support here and live, and live peacefully. Some people don't want to fight. People don't want to get hurt. And there's an old saying. Don't put it on your back if it's not in your heart. So don't put on support here if it's not in your heart. If confronted by a rival MC, we as an MC would expect a good supporter to walk away with the support here intact. And that will be acknowledged. And maybe one day, they may have the privilege of wearing the patch. At the end of the day, it's all about heart. But if you don't have the heart, and you let fear get in your way, then you will not last that long in the club. So before you go accepting support gear, make sure you know what's in your heart. And you, to know the risk involved when you agree to take the support gear and to wear it and to be posting stuff about the support your local don't act surprised when something happens and don't be going power running back to the MC that you support and tattletelling about some other MC you gotta handle your business this video is a short answer to that question so at the end of the day like I keep saying don't wear it on your back if it's not in your heart. And make sure you're in it for the right reason. Know what you're, what you're getting yourself into. And that's what you want. Because, I mean, we want people to be wearing it loud and proud. Alright guys, till next week, much love and respect. Peace.